are very excited to show you and tell you all about our cruise we are going on. But first, we've got to get there. So first, we'll be getting the bus to Leeds train station. Then it is about an hour and a half of a train ride to Newcastle train station. Jeez, it's just <laughs> the last minute of the train literally just coming out. Like... Oh, you can't see. We'll then be getting two buses to the port. Probably. And here we are at the terminal. <laughs> it's... yes. Thank you. That was simple. Yeah. <laughs> got quite a queue, haven't we? <laughs> Drinks included. Yes. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Thank you. Thank you very much. Have a lovely time. Hello. We're on a bus. We're on a bus. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. <laughs> I didn't know they were waiting for me. Oh, that was quick. Okay. Hello. <laughs> Hello and welcome to our room tour. So to the left of you right now there is the bathroom. Then to your right you have wardrobes with loads of mirrors. Whoa, there's life jackets, there's a kettle, milk. Please be advised, we're using the kettle, it's fully closed. And then in this one, there's a safe and coat hanger as well. Look how many coat hangers there are. That is good. <laughs> then in this one, just some more kind of coat hanger space, which is always good on a cruise, especially if you've got a small kind of room. Straight ahead, we have a massive bed. It is two singles put together. You have your baggage only thing, so you don't get the bed dirty, which I really like. Then here we have a bedside table. Then if you look over to me, we have a lovely desk with loads of information on it if you want to come have a look. Set out very nice life. Yeah, there's loads of things, <laughs> like I mean loads, and your daily times. And a TV channels with the remote. Oh yeah. Hey, we got the earlier one. That is good. Tells us about that our is very dinner useful. times. We have a drawer. Oh, holy Bible and a hair dryer. It is European. We were told. No, it it's UK as well. Oh. So a top tip then it is British and European plugs on here. <laughs> And then you have a pop for the fridge. And again? No. No. We do have water here though. Ah. Mm -hmm. Then cupboard. And like this. Yeah. In case it gets rocky, which we are going into the North Sea, so that might happen. <laughs> we have a chair that I have used for all my stuff. I think it's quite stuff. a nice chair. I know. It, it matches the nice. wall. And then another white and a so just to add on this is all the little things you get so if it's rough weather it will say and flash here alarm you can turn it off so announcement we could say off so it won't announce in our room or on that is radio so different ones and then this is the volume of the radio so yeah. I, like that. I do too it's yeah. quite nice isn't it yeah so we're currently at the top and the front of the ship at the marquee bar and through there behind me is the observation lounge which is like a nice little lounge bar area with a nice view around the ship just over the bridge <laughs> so we're going to be doing it from the from this and then going all the way to the back and then we're going to go down at the front bit and then go all the way back and then the down at the front and then that's how we're going to do the cruise tour you know, at the entrance to those lifts 
a nice background bar around the front of the cruise. Yeah. Here are the lifts, and then we'll just go and show you the wraparound. Yeah. So that'll be where the entertainment will be. Yeah. Well, some piano so playing. Yeah. So if you're halfway with sat, we're going to have jacuzzis and the pool. How is it? Quite warm, actually. That woman said there's actually changing rooms. I think there, I think it's quite there. Ah, okay. So there, right? We've got the changing rooms here. Yeah. So you can go in there and don't be so cold for anything. Go straight in the changing rooms. Wait, where you can uh, kick your board. <laughs> actually got so it doesn't screw up. Just make sure you get everything. <laughs> We've ticked off deck 11. So now we're going to move down to deck 10. Yay! That was amazing. Let's go have a look. Open 7 to 8. No one's in. Oh, perfect. So this is the gym, this is at the front of deck 10. Oh yeah, and this is the front as well, yeah, yeah. You're literally like running where you're going. That's amazing. You've actually got loads of things in here. So in here is the salon, right next to the gym. The gym's just down there. And then we're gonna go this way and continue the tour. So all along the middle of deck 10, Cabins. Full of so cabins. <laughs> now we're going to go all the way to the back of the ship to have a look at the two restaurants that are on this deck. Something useful of not this kind of corner, but maybe this one. You can see. There's a lot of corners. Yeah, you can see Jacob. Come back, Jacob. You can see him walk there. Hi. So you don't just run into each other. <laughs> Here is the restaurant menu for one of the ones we're going to be showing you. This one is for the Spee restaurant, or Spey? S-P-E-Y, I'm trying to say it. This okay. one here, it is shut so we can't show you right, no, inside. No. But it looks really nice. And there's even like circle windows which I think is oh, quite, yeah, cute. quite cute. Yeah, <laughs> that is that restaurant. <laughs> yes, I think they're just preparing actually. Um, this, okay, that's Jacob's head. <laughs> this is what it's called in case Jacob does not know how to pronounce it at all. <laughs> also, have the toilets here while walking out and back to the lifts. And that, that is this deck done. Now we're down to deck nine. <laughs> At the front of deck nine, obviously, at the front is the bridge where they drive the boat. Which we're not allowed, so we won't be able to show you. <laughs> After the bridge, we're in the midway of the ship and all the way to the end of the ship to the laundry, it's just cabins. After all the cabins here, if you go this way, there is the laundry room, which Jacob is just investigating. <laughs> so, at the back of deck nine is the laundry room. I don't know if you can hear me in here, it's very loud, but it's got dryers and washers and ironing boards, which is very good equipped. So right now we're on deck eight and the front of the ship and the middle is just cabin. So we're going to fast forward to the back. I actually realise how much a cruise tour gets your steps in. Comment down below what you think my steps are going to be after this. <laughs> we're currently sat in the Lido lounge and bar where I believe some entertainment will happen. And the bar is from here. Very nice windows for you at the back. And now we've got signs. Yeah. This is cool. It's very crowded here. We have another view of the back of the ship's pool. This is where the entertainment will be, however, there is a rehearsal in process. So There's the atrium on deck seven, which has got the boutique and basically a watch shop and a little bit of expensive shops basically, and live music going on right now. Yeah. Ah, the atrium. Oh, and live music. Actually surrounded by loads of light things you can buy. And now is the bookmark cafe. It's like a nice little cafe where you can get a nice drink. It does actually, it's a look. Room. So, games room, I assume. Games room where you can play card games, yeah. So, this is the Earth room, 
Just be like, oh, for reading and do some work. Home here is the morning, the morning light, light pub, which is a nice little pub, it looks like. Yeah. So, if you see this, this goes all the way around the ship. And if you go around it four times, you can walk one way. So, on deck seven, uh, near the bus, we're at Palms Cafe, which, probably not, because I'm going to go in now. <laughs> Seven, we're at where the two jacuzzis are, or whirlpools as they call them, <laughs> and the pool which seems to be closed right now. So the front of deck six is just cabins, so we'll fast forward to the atrium. So now we're on the overlooking part on deck six of the atrium. It's pretty! <laughs> So this is the photo area, main area, and also the flower shop. That's which really is nice. Really nice. Yeah. Oh, what, look at this! Oh my gosh, it's like surrounded. This is the um, like awards and medals they get for every single port that they've visited. Wow. So you see, like oh, yeah, June the twenty ninth, two thousand and eight. That's pretty. Very pretty. That's it. That's quite this is the Ball and Dock restaurant. I don't think it's open, but it looks really no. nice. No. So deck five and four are purely cabins, so we won't really show that because it isn't that interesting. So we're on the way to deck three, which has only got the medical centre, laundry room, and the Olsen All Art. Studio. <laughs> There's a lot of words that I don't want to pronounce. We're currently on deck three. There are cabins, a laundry room, medical center, and an art studio. Let's go check it out. So this is the art studio. It's nice actually. It's very empty. <laughs> hey, there's a snail. This is cool. Look at this. Oh, she will world. Wow. Not ready yet. <laughs> you can also iron things, which yeah. is nice, in case it's wrinkly for... I don't think I'll hurt you. God, cold. Thank you for watching our video. That is the end of the cabin tour and cruise tour. Um, we hope you enjoyed and there is far more to come. So why don't you subscribe and stay tuned. Bye! Hi guys, we hope you enjoyed the video of the cabin tour and cruise tour. I'm quickly going to go through what we got prior to our departure because I find it interesting and it's quite good to know. So, three weeks before we departed on our cruise, we got these in the mail. Get six of these um, free of our luggage labels, which you get to put on your suitcases and stuff that you don't want to actually carry around with you and they just put it on for you. Also get allocated a certain colour, which for us, we are pink. These are very straightforward. You just get rid of, let me give you an example. So you get rid of this and this, so it looks like this. Then you put this bit like that into there like that put it all the way through so that bit is on your luggage there and then this shows your colour and then this just shows your information which we actually think is very helpful that they send them off because we don't have a printer so for like the MSC cruise we went on quite a while ago we had to actually print them off ourselves which we didn't which is why I thought I'd make this video so it is a lot easier for instructions this also came in the post it is a letter just saying your luggage labels are enclosed which they were <laughs> and then for the smoothest check-in um blah 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 it just says call this number in case you didn't know that your allocated check-in time can be found on the website and it gives you the website then on the back it's just a few questions that you might have prior to departing so how much luggage can i take uh, hand luggage tips blah 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 it also comes with a nice booklet which is pre-departure guide which just basically has a few pages um 
before you leave home so about parking travel insurance if you feel unwell newcastle so it actually gives you where exactly you need to arrive to and the postcode which is very useful it says we look forward to welcome you on board which i think is really cute and i love that they have actually sent it via post so we don't have to print anything off we hope you enjoyed this video and there is many more to come so subscribe and stay tuned bye, bye. Thank <laughs> you.